Hello, most people are wrong to evaluate this question. You should use this trick to solve for x from 36 root of x plus 24 root of x is equals to 26 root of x. First, to solve for x from this question, from 36 root of x plus 24 root of x is equals to 16 root of x. Then, next step we divide by 36 root of x in both sides. Then, after dividing 36 root of x in both sides, here this and this will cancel. So here to remain 1. 1 plus 24 over 36 all root of x is equal to 16 over 36 all root of x. Then, next step. 1 plus here 36 over 24 over 36 can be simplified as 2 over 3 root of x is equals to here 16 over 36 can be simplified as 4 over 9 so here it will be root of x inside is 2 over 3 bracket square 2 square is 4 3 square is 9 then we apply the rule that a m root is equals to a 1 power of 1 over m so our equation will be 1 plus 2 over 3 bracket power of 1 over x is equals to 2 over 3 bracket power of 2 bracket power of 1 over x now from the right side of the equation we apply the rule that a power of m bracket power of n is equals to a power of n bracket power of m so we exchange the power inside the bracket so it will be 1 plus 2 over 3 power of 1 over x is equals to 2 over 3 power of 1 over x bracket power of 2 now we let 2 over 3 bracket power of 1 over x is equals to t so our equation will be 1 plus here we let is equals to t is equals to t square so note that 1 plus t is equals to t square let's go on the next page from 1 plus t is equals to t square we make this equation in form of quadratic equation so t we move to the right side and 1 to the right side so it will be t square minus t minus 1 is equals to 0 now from quadratic general quadratic equation that t is equals to negative b plus or minus b square minus 4ac square root over 2a Fr from the this quadratic equation a is 1 b is equals to negative 1 and c is equals to negative 1 
So this value we substitute to quadratic equation t will be equals to negative 1 bracket times negative 1 plus or minus b square is negative 1 square minus 4 times a which is 1 times c which is negative 1 divide by 2a which is 1. So t will be equals to 1 plus or minus here will be 1 my plus negative and negative is plus 4 divide by 2 so this will be equals to 1 plus or minus square root of 5 divided by 2 so we have two solution here t is equals to 1 plus square root of 5 divide by 2 and t is equals to 1 minus square root of t divide by 2 so here 1 is t is equals to 1 minus square root of t divide by 2 is less than 0 so when is less than 0 this value of t is rejected so now we are dealing with this positive value from the value of t what is t t remember we let that t is equals to 2 over 3 power of 1 over x so we substitute here 2 over 3 power of 1 over x is equals to 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2. Now, final step. We apply log to solve for the value of x from this equation. So, we apply log in both sides. So, to be log of 2 over 3 bracket power of 1 over x is equals to log 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 from from the log rule log of m power of n is equals to n log of m so when we apply this rule it will be 1 over x log of 2 over 3 is equals to log of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2. Now, note this equation. Let's go on the next page. From one over x log of two over three bracket is equals to log of one plus square root of five over two. We multiply by x in both sides so as to remove the fraction. So to be log of two over three is equals to x log of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 then we divide by log 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 in both sides so this will cancel we cancel so x will be equals to log of 2 over 3 divided by log of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 now from here we apply the rule that log of m divided by n is equals to log of m minus log of n so when you apply this rule x will be equals to log of 2 minus log of 3 divided by log of 1 plus root of 5 minus 
log of 2. Then we know that the value of log of 2 is equals to 0 0.301 and the value of log of 3 is equals to 0 0.47 and value of 1 plus square root of 5 is equals to 0 0.51 now we substitute this value x will be equals to log of 2 is 0 0.301 minus log of 3 is 0 0.47 divided by log of 1 plus square root of 5 is 0, 0 0.51 0 0.51 minus log of 2 is 0 0.31 so 0 0.301 minus 0 0.47 is equals to negative 0 0.17 divided by 0 0.51 minus 0 0.501 it will be equals to 0 0.21 so x is equals to negative 0 0.17 divided by 0 0.21 x will be equals to negative 0 0.84 Three. So this is the answer.